250 million kids on the planet who don't have access to learning. It's as simple as that. It's really expensive to ship books. It's really expensive to do teacher training. It's really expensive to do all of these things that help education. We don't have the ability to build all the schools and hire all the teachers that we need to teach children the world over. It's really such a shame if we're not using innovation and technology to do something about that. Technology allows us to reach children at the scale that's needed, that they deserve. How can you use technology to help them learn faster and more effectively? To me, that seems like a perfect challenge. If we can do that, if we can give this generation, 250 million children around the world, the ability to read, it opens up a new world for them. And the Global Learning X Prize is the platform we need to run this grand experiment to see if this is truly possible. The competition is a challenge to teams to develop software and content in both Swahili and English that is designed to bring children from zero literacy to literacy in 18 months in reading, writing, and math. The prize is the releasing of the potential of probably 50 million, possibly 100, hopefully 250 million children who are not functionally literate. This competition is really important for the world because to reach equality, the first step is to educate everybody. Every person must have the right to basic education uh, from day one. Education and literacy are so important because without literacy, what can you do? If someone is illiterate, despite all the content out there, they cannot benefit from it. So we have to help people unlock level one before they can move on to all the other levels that life has to offer. We come from South Africa. We see the children who need this app around us every day. But why we continued with what we are doing. We really think about it in terms of closing that literacy gap that exists for not just the children in Tanzania in a remote village, but ultimately uh, in urban areas of Detroit, Chicago, LA, uh, even New York. So it's not something that is somebody else's problem. One Billion has a rather grand ambition. Uh, we want to see a billion children reading uh, with confidence uh, and basically numerate as well to serve as a foundation for their education and we believe um, XPRIZE is going to be a, a catalyst for this scalable quality education. 25 years, 50 years down the lane someone's going to look back and say this is when learning changed. Even if the penetration of smartphone and tablets devices is not yet perfect, it's just a matter of time. The cost of tablets is coming down to a point where the computational horsepower is affordable on a massive scale, if not right now, then certainly by the time the competition ends. Everyone who's brought technology to third world country, it doesn't take kids a second to just get engaged, even if they've never seen a, a device. We spent quite a bit of time in Tanzania and Kenya um, testing our apps in all sorts of environments, meeting all these kids, and it was really wonderful to um, see what happens when they had this tablet in their hands and the joy that that can bring to children who are so eager for learning opportunities. It was really, really encouraging and heartwarming to see. I'm so excited what, what the Global Learning X Prize is doing because what happens when you unlock minds that learn to read and I'm so excited to see what these kids are going to be able to contribute to the world because they can read because they can write and because they can do basic numeracy it's like the yes time for global learning